when you come to me with a conflict of interest, you basically disclose to me your personal relationship, your financial involvement, your familial involvement, whatever it happens to be, and you'd be surprised how complicated the life of some, of some people are. You don't want to share that with the public. You don't want me to disclose it, etc. MPs on the Ethics Committee bumping up against the limits of what the Ethics Commissioner can and can't talk about. Conrad von Finkenstein was asked to testify on what he knew about the Prime Minister's most recent Jamaican vacation. But von Finkenstein said, though the trip was clearly generous, as a gift from a friend, it broke no rules. They have been friends since Mr. Trudeau was a, uh, was a child. He has visited this place. Mr. Green has visited uh, uh, Canada. He's been at 24 Sussex. He's been at Harrington <coughs> Lake. They have, they, they, uh, he is the godfather of one of his, uh, of his brothers. I don't see why just because they're well off, they can't exchange gifts. The Ethics Commissioner's Office did communicate with the Prime Minister's Office ahead of the trip over email with no direct contact between the two men, but von Finkenstein and his staff couldn't disclose what was in the emails. In the absence of more substance, MPs took aim at trips sponsored by third parties like think tanks or foreign nations. We talked about the strange case of uh, five Conservative MPs who took a lavish trip to London in summer of 2023. Included in the expenses were 600 bottles of champagne, porterhouse steaks, Chateaubriand, and a smoked salmon, which cost over $6,200. Miss uh, uh, Igra Khalid accepted a sponsored uh, travel in 2017 to the United Arab Emirates and uh, billed, or the value was $8,518. The leader of the NDP, Jagmeet Singh, in August of 2022, he and three staff went to Las Vegas, paid for by United Steel Workers, a total of $7,919. The NDP's Matthew Green later moved that if everybody is abusing the system, perhaps MPs need to be barred from sponsored trips entirely. The conflict of interest code for members of the House of Commons be amended to explicitly ban sponsored travel. That passed unanimously, but that code is covered by the Procedure Committee, not Ethics. The recommendation now goes to that committee for review. In Ottawa, Shaoli Lee, City News.